This is a very basic tutorial to show you how to code a program in Scratch that will add two numbers together. Under data, we're going to be making three variables. In computer programming, we like to store values in variables to make the code more readable and to also make it work properly. So you go to make a variable and you're going to call the first variable first num for the first number. The second variable will be for the second number. And finally, you need a sum, which will be the sum of the two numbers added together. Under events, we always start our programs with when the green flag is clicked, usually anyway. And then now we can go ahead and give our variables an initial value. So under make a variable, get that set block and change the first number to zero. And this is if we run the program more than once change the second number to zero, and then change the sum to zero. To ask the information for user and to store information, you're going to go under sensing, and we'll ask the user, what is the first number? You need the answer block as well. Under data, go to set, and we're going to set that first number equal to the user's answer. So we've now stored whatever the user typed in as their first number, into the variable called first num. Now we can ask the user for the second number. And use that answer block as well. Under data, go to set, and we're going to set the second number equal to the user answer. We can add them together now. In order to do that, we have to use the set block under data, and we're going to set sum equal to the two numbers added together. So under operators, get the add operator and go back to data. And we're going to add the first number to the second number. And it will store that value into the variable called sum. So let's output that information to the user. So let's tell the user the sum of the two numbers is I'm going to say that for three seconds. And in the second block, I'll just use the save block for the second one so it stays until the user starts the program again. Go to say, and for data, you just throw in the sum variable value. So it will say the sum of the two numbers is, it will hold that speech bubble for three seconds, and then in the next speech bubble, it will tell the sum of the two numbers. And we calculated that in this line here and we're just going to output the value in this last line of code. Let's run our program and make sure it works. What is the first number? Let's try four. The second number, I'm going to enter in three. Press enter. The sum of the two numbers is seven. And you can see the variable values right here. You can unselect those if you don't want that to be shown to the user. But when I'm troubleshooting, I like to actually see the values of my variables. If I click the green flag again, everything will be reset to zero and the user can try the program out again. Good luck with that program.